It's the Joel Shit Show featuring Joel Shit. <clears throat> Hi, and welcome to the Joel Shit Show. I'm your host, Joel Shit. So I went to the gym yesterday and I gave him my card and they scanned it and then she handed me a punch card with two punches on it. And I said, oh boy, we're doing this again. When they have a punch card at the gym, usually, you know, it's got a bunch of numbers on it. Every time you come into the gym, they punch the next number. And when you fill the card up, you get entered into the drawing for something you don't want. But along the way, to help encourage you, because if you only had a prize after like, you know, 30 workouts, people aren't going to be encouraged. But maybe after 20 workouts, you get a water bottle. Or 10 workouts, you get a t-shirt. I'm listening. Now I'm motivated. So, there's a promotion that apparently started March 1st. Yesterday I went in, gave me a punch card, I had two punches on it, there's only 15 numbers on it, look, this is March 1 through 31st. And I said, hey, the big idea, I've been here all month. And she said, oh yeah, we sort of forgot to give those out, so we're giving everybody two punches when they come in in the second half of the month, so that way it all balances out. Well, that's fine, except I'm going to Reno for a week in six days, and there's no Valley Total Fitnesses over there, and even if there were, I bet you that they delivered their cards on the 1st of March, and everyone up there gets one punch for every visit. So, by the way, if you go to a Valley Total Fitness that isn't in Los Gatos, you should start going to the one in Los Gatos the rest of this month. You'll fill your card up faster. Although, really, 15 workouts in a month, how hard is that? So here's the thing. After 10, I get a t-shirt, and when I fill the whole card up, I get a water bottle and a sports bag. And I don't really need a sports bag, but I'll find a use for it. Since I won't buy a giant-ass bag for all my hockey shit, I might as well have a bunch of little bags for my hockey shit. And I've got one for my shin guards and my gloves, so I could use one for my helmet and my shoes. So, there. Now I just gotta go to the gym seven and a half times. But the Reno thing, I can't do that. So what am I gonna do? Well. It's time to kick it old school. We're going to put volleyball on the shelf for a few weeks, which really isn't that big of a deal because I barely am going once a week now because of hockey. And I'm going to split up my workout and I'm going to do upper body and lower body on opposite days and do cardio both days. So now my workouts will be shorter, but I'll be working out more time overall because I'll be doing cardio twice as often. So that's where I'm headed after I upload this episode even though I was just there yesterday. Another side benefit of this, I get to use their showers every day, which not only means I don't have to buy conditioner because I'm almost out, but I get to use a shower with real water pressure, so everybody wins. That's all the time we have for today. Visit us on the web at joelshitshow.com. Email joel at joelshitshow.com.